So here's the test setup. You have an SDL3530R TAC, a switch with both fiber and copper ethernet, and a computer that is logged into the RTAC at its IP address, which is 192.168.1.9. So I'm going to click the set switch on button. You can see it sent a message to the RTAC, which updated the contact I.O. status bit and turned on the contact I.O., which turned on the larger relay, turned on the lamp. You notice there's a lag in the local indication here, and that's because the tag processor is running every two seconds. So it took two seconds to receive back the information that the local auxiliary LED had been updated here as a local indicator and reflect that on the HMI remotely. And if I click switch off, you can see the change happens quickly and there's a little bit of lag in enunciating that here, which mirrors the fact that aux one LED is off again. So you have data transmission via fiber and copper. You have data display, um, processing on HMI and data collection collecting this switch status. It's a complete SCADA project.